All right, developing tonight, a local Montgomery County woman is recovering after testing positive for the West Nile virus. This marks the first human case in Texas this year. Here in Harris County, the mosquito and vector control have tested 4,000 mosquitoes and meteorologist Daji Aswa joining us now from the gallery. Daji, how many mosquitoes have tested positive for the virus? Yes, so far 295 groups of mosquitoes out of that 4,000 have tested positive. Compare that to 2023 last year, only 50 groups tested positive for West Nile virus. So why the big difference? Well, it's because of the way that they're testing. They have better testing systems in place that can get results back faster and even more accurate. And this is all that change is all a part of making a safer and healthier community when it comes to mosquito season here in Houston, Texas. Um, when you do have a positive, it displays this sigmoidal um, curve right here. Virologists at Harris County Mosquito and Vector Control are testing for a variety of diseases like West Nile and even Zika. Once mosquitoes test positive, action is taken. If mosquitoes test positive, you actually go and treat those yes, areas. That's the time that we will treat. So when we treat that particular area that was tested positive, we will also treat surrounding areas in order to, to get an impact, in order to get a knockdown of the mosquito species that may carry the West Nile virus. This week they had a positive human case in Montgomery County, you know, and so if we're quickly killing these um, virus ridden mosquitoes, we maybe we could have um, totally um, steer clear of that. While Harris County is misting neighborhoods that are testing positive for West Nile virus, you can do some things at home and it starts with your wardrobe. They suggest wearing bright colors because mosquitoes love dark spaces. And if you're wearing a black shirt, they'll be more likely to sit and bite you. And don't forget to grab EPA approved bug spray and make sure to reapply it. You also want to remove things like unused tires and containers that can pull water because mosquitoes can breed in those environments. So listen to all those tips and tricks and the Harris County uh, mosquito and vector control will do their part by spraying those zip codes that have those tests that have tested positive. And if you head to click to Houston, I'm working on an article right now about how their system works as well as what zip codes are testing positive for West Nile. And you can type your address in and see if you fall in any of the zip codes and if they are testing in the Galleria Dodgy Aswad KPRC 2 News.